Basically, I have things. Um, yeah, this other thing is you'll see reminder text as part of uh, modal spells. So each modal will have like a reminder text next to it. It's just pretty cool. Yeah, kind of cool. <laughs> if they have like uh, collections back to whatever, they, they're just missing the reminder text. But that, that's all for Modern Horizon 2. Like, um, all the yeah, cards in the actual set had it, but like then like the, yeah. the edge yeah. alternate versions didn't have it. I haven't seen them, so I don't know. Well, until you need the two skeletons. So the first pack didn't have a dungeon. But the second so we're going to do this with a little bit different from tools. Interesting. Yeah. So yeah. 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 Sorry, sorry, look at this. Well, that's that's crazy. Right Freak out. Yeah. Yeah, those are the uh, special frames for this one. Um, wait, wait until you get the special special frame lands. Oh. <laughs> is there a ton of text on them? Uh, no. They look like D and D modules. Oh, cool. Yeah. I have open one pack on the red. So for wish, can I go into an EDH deck? <laughs> Slot <Slug> Garrett. <laughs> well, five color. <laughs> what is it? Uh, you may Whip. play a card you own from outside this game. <laughs> Nice. Going to an EDH check. I pull out. Uh, Jewel Lotus. Don't stop me. <laughs> I think it has to be in your pool. Yeah, yeah. For seal. Until I play EDH. And then I'm going into my trade mine. Got some Well, okay. Huh. It's kind of like the Sun Triplets of sorts. This is the. Ray is reading the cards for the first time. Yeah, I've never read this stuff. My bad. <laughs> Can't look down either. Do <laughs> the. Whispers of the Green. Yeah. So you have. Interesting. Interesting. There's a lot going on. Stuff. I get the two blood here, but 
Well, that's pretty. That's the Volgan Miles. Did you hear any of the actual part? No. It's so weird. The bag of Volgan Miles. Yes, it was. Okay. Just I'll just revert to Ray. Yeah, you asked the card about this set. I'm like, I know Evolving Wilds. I just see it's a reprint. <laughs> Ray's middle name. Yeah. <laughs> Thought it was Dean Amyar. <laughs> I mean, no, don't associate me. <laughs> I don't know that person. <laughs> don't know that person. <laughs> This is like classic D&D art. Is that what this is? Yes, so I think so. I think that's what it's supposed to emulate anyway. Oh that's yeah, the... that's that's the style of art that they had in the first one. Cool. Good. I can dig it, Watsy. I can dig it. All of it. Um, that's why like all, whoops, all 50 that they got in there, that just to be able to try to hit the color, yeah, that's a, I mean, it could. You got a few? Everybody else will be, you just you know, the dude would be. I can be I was like, I was like, Hey, 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 Garrison. Do you open one too? That one? Wait, what did you open? <laughs> oh, gelatinous ooze. Don't worry, gelatinous Garrison. Cube. You know gelatinous that age old, if you ooze, you lose. For that. Hey, you know what? I won a lot. So <laughs> I opened ooze in uh, guilds, whatever, the one that uh, biogenic ooze that was copy itself. And they were like, oh, this is the nuts. If you open this, you win. And I lost around one of the GP and dropped. And I said, well, you know what they say, if you ooze, you lose. <laughs> so, after that, I refuse to touch oozes. Predatory ooze and all. <laughs> Alright, what's this do? Plus four, plus oh? That's interesting. The greater. Just super expensive real quick. Yeah. <laughs> White has some really good equipment. If you get them. Like plate armor. There's plate armor. I think it's white. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He also has Delver's sword. I was like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, this is a slower game or slower format. Uh, I played a game last night. We went to turns in game. Oh, really? I didn't finish. <laughs> I like to hear that. That means that when I read these cards and I call five mana to activate their plate. <laughs> I mean, sealed's always a little slower, but. Yeah. You know, like back when they used to do like the guild packs, it would kind of force like Boros or Rectus or something to go really fast. So this is really different. You are that means I'm going to build a faster. <laughs> that third open. Or the game. Yeah. Second booster. Yeah, I guess I should read my ribs. That's fine. So, we'll have to check out the videos to see what we end up building. How is it going to be? Cool. 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 Always. Cars seems messed up. I think 
So with the level cards, do they automatically sacrifice, kind of like how uh, sagas work? Nope. nope. They stay in the battlefield. Oh, interesting. Yeah. So you can keep. Oh, you can't. And you can have multiples of them. Yeah. So in the so as you level up, it keeps it has remembrance of level one. You go to level two, you have level one and level two abilities. It works like a D and D character. Yeah. Cool. Okay. So then, this card, for instance, it says at the beginning of the giant step, if a creature died this turn, each opponent loses one life. Mm -hmm. That happens no matter what, as long as this is in play, mm -hmm. because it's always going to have that ability. Right. So it, when it when you cast it, it automatically becomes level one. Right. So then, if you want level one and level two, you pay two mana. Right. At sorcery speed. Right. And then let's say I go up to level three. Can I pay two mana and go back to level two? No. Okay. No, you always have level two still. Oh, so you it just, just can't reactivate now. it. Yeah. Oh, so it only triggers once then. Right. Gotcha. Okay. And so then this would always be a static ability. Once right. This only triggers, and then. This would trigger once I hit level three every time. Yeah. Wow. Interesting. Yeah. I managed to find a cluster. Yeah, so you can kind of see, like this one has. Produce damage. So then that always happens. Yep. And then you can give your creatures menace, and then that always happens. Yep. And then you do this. Wow. So that card just gets bananas. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, classes are cool unless it's the bard class and you don't have anything like it. <laughs> yeah. Not quite so good, but... Wow, and then they stack, you said. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, so... You can have four Wolfwatch classes. If yeah, you if you had, like... It's... Yeah, so if you have... Uh, That's it. Multiples, you can... Yeah. Oh, wow. I don't want really to stack that. Yeah. Interesting. I bet you that's going to be a standard deck then. And <laughs> this Warlock class card. That's pretty powerful. Yeah. I think you could like... build just about any of the classes into a deck. Right. Like they're, mm. they're all. Yeah. They're all good unless you're not playing any legendary creatures. That's <laughs> Cool. All right, well, all my black's playable. Great. This is your fault.
Sheesh. That guy seems sick. What are you? The wizard spell book. If you hit a 20, yikes. Yeah. Turns it's out. also five mana. Probably. Yeah. No, it's no, seven. 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 Yeah. Never mind. Yeah, it's expensive. Yeah. But if I roll that 20, though, it's going off. Huh. Interesting. What's the stuff? It's good. Have you seen what treasure press does? Uh uh. So it's three mana, and you can, and once you start using four mana, sacrifice it to deep one. On a natural one, you lose three life. <laughs> Two through nine, you get five pressure tokens. Wow. Ten through nineteen, gain three life, draw three cards. And then on a twenty, you can search library for any card. If it's an artifact, it goes to the battlefield, otherwise it goes to your hand. Huh. I kind of just don't even want to hit twenty with that. Honestly. I know. You really have. I just want to, I, I want 10 through 19. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just don't that. It's I a mean, dark card. 2 through 9 ain't bad if you want to. That's true, yeah. too. Especially because, like, yeah, I mean, you're always off this. Other than one. Lose, yeah, lose, yeah, other than the, the lose don't life. That one and you're fine. Yeah. That's crazy. Man, this card seems good, too, though. Man, I just don't know. This is all playable too. All these cards seem great for limited. So that, that card seems good too, though. Huh. Yep, there's 40 cards in her sleeve. Seems good too. Seems good. Phased out. Wow. Oh, yeah, phasing is back. That's so wild. <laughs> yeah, all these cards are nuts. I mean, like, do I just, I just do that? Is that, is that the move? These cards all seem like good. That seems kind of cool. Seems great. Oh, can they? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, they fixed that. Oh, I think it was probably with the fairy then. Yeah, it was. That makes sense. Yeah. So I do briefly remember that. But the fairy was like the only card in the set that could do it. Or even the format, rather. Hmm. I got one. 
Bro, GP. Pressing plus two. Green, green, red. With splashing light. Oh. And I actually only have to bleed two points because I got an android vest. Oh. Yeah. So I think I can just do this. But I think I have to do this. I need to be to six I traded out Ranger Longbow for Delver Sword to get for this. It's minus a power. That's good, good, good. Good. I think I'm going to want to put in the so I'm splashing up the point of the You can draw like that. Yeah. I have no And my only source of treasures was to provide weaponry and treasure chest, so. So that I can get four health chests. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think it's fine. Okay. Just make sure you're playing enough. Can I move up from two? Yeah. You should probably play more. Okay. I'm going to turn you move up. Bless you. So yeah, then that was some boys, three points. Alright, we'll do that. Now we're moving on boys. Yeah. Right. I got very lucky.